Name the Game's Game Break, presented by CBE, competition-inspired hunting sites. All right, this week I want to talk to you a little bit about setting your peep height and, and where to set it, what distances to set it. You know, I don't ever take just a standard measurement, and that's my peep height for every bow. Every one I set up is different. As you can see, I haven't tied this peep in yet. I've got it close. You know, I'll use a measurement to get me close to start with, but every bow I set up is for a different reason. For me, I may be going to a 3D shoot where I'm shooting out to 50, or Redding where I'm shooting out to 100, or Vegas where I'm shooting at 20 yards, or even my hunting bow. So you really want to take into consideration, what is this bow going to be for? And that's going to tell you where you want to set your peep height. If I'm going to Redding, if this bow is going to be shot in Redding, I'm shooting out to 100 yards. So I want to take that average distance, probably going to be 40 yards. Most of my shots are going to be between 30, 60, but I'm shooting out to 100. So I still want to be decently comfortable at 100. I'm going to set my peep height at about 40 or 45 yards. And for instance, if I'm going to Vegas, every shot's at 20 yards, where do you think I'm going to set my peep? 20 yards, because that's where it's the most comfortable. That's where I need it to be comfortable. If I'm going to a 3D shoot where I'm shooting out to 50, I'm going to set it right in the middle, probably 30 yards, 25 yards. I'm going to set my peep there to be comfortable. So if I shoot at 20, I'm not very uncomfortable. If I shoot at 50, I'm not very uncomfortable. You always want to take into consideration your distances and set it with a good average because every time you change distance, your anchor changes minutely because you're, you're moving your, your aim and dot. So um, you don't want to set it at 20 and then try to go shoot at 100 because it's going to be super uncomfortable. So you know, that's a good tip that's really helped me over the years is, is learning how to set my peep height in the middle of my effective range. I think it's going to help you too.